Okay. Hello! Welcome to your week. <laughs> what are we going to talk about today, Lana? So, today it's Mythbuster Monday. And on Mythbuster Monday, I asked Dr. Murphy questions. And he determines whether or not it is a myth or it is fact. Okay. You think you can handle that? Yeah. Okay, so today, Dr. Murphy, you are being asked if it is true that you can only get mono once. Therefore, if you get mono once, you'll never get it again, kind of like the chicken pox. I think I've read cases to where you can actually get it again, but they're rare and remote. And, uh, you know, for all practical purposes, no, you can't get it again. Okay. Because you develop antibodies to it. There's actually two tests. One's a, what they call a model spot, which tests for what they call acute antibodies. So they can tell us real quick, and they, they, they rise real quick. But if I, or possibly you, were to go get tested for model right now, the acute part would be negative, but the latent or, or um, resistance or antibodies to it would be positive. So it means we've been exposed to it and we got to work. Cool. But everybody gets it at some point in their life. Okay. We've well, seen a lot of it lately, too. Really? Mm hmm Why? Uh, I think it's just time of year. Kids go back to college and stuff. That's oh, when you see a lot of just, yeah. School, People college. are just around each other more. Yeah. Okay. And then mono is what exactly? Real quick? Viral. And it is what? What is it? Well, it's just a virus. It's just a virus. And usually how you get it? Uh, water just droplets like a flu. on something. Yeah, you know, flu. Flu, flu, type, flu type stuff. Respiratory droplets. It's stuff not like. always kissing. Can be. Can be. Um, can be, but it isn't always. Correct. Okay. Well, there you have it. And if you get mono, what do you do? Nothing. You just write it out. Suck it up, buttercup. There's no medication? Nope. So really, you're just going into someone to discern whether or not you have mono, and then you're like, okay, well, good luck with that. Yeah, it can be really kind of confusing, too, because mono can look a lot like no well, tonsillitis and stuff, so it's not, oh. it's not the easiest thing in the world to uh, see okay. and recognize. And typically, when I do see it, you know, and I'm a little bit in doubt, it's like, uh, put you on some antibiotics, but I always warn them, too. Well, if you're not better in a couple of days, guess what? It's probably mono. Okay. All right. That's I it. Think that's everything. That's it? Mono Mondays. Oh, okay. Have a good Monday. Have a good Monday. We'll see you tomorrow for... It's not a trash talk, but it's talk. We'll trash it. Okay. See you then.